Hi there, welcome to the video. Today I'm going to show you how you can download the Windows 10 2004 Enterprise ISO directly from Microsoft. Hope you find this guide useful. If you do, please help me out by subscribing to my channel. Okay, I've written an article here that I'm going to link to in the description. Uh, the first thing we need to do is uh, download the Windows 10 installation media tool. So if you just scroll down and underneath this heading here, download the Microsoft tool, just click on here. It's going to bring you to this page this is the actual Microsoft website you can see Microsoft.com there scroll down and where it says create Windows 10 installation media just click on that uh, I've already downloaded the tool it creates this media creation tool 2004 copy that somewhere on your system that you can access easy so I'm just going to put it into the C temp folder uh, if we go back to my article here, scroll down a little bit. We need to open up the command prompt. So if you just click on the start menu, type in CMD, left click on the command prompt, then you're going to need to copy and paste this command here. So if you've put the tool in a different place to see temp, uh, just take change the location there uh, but just copy and paste that from my website I just got prompted by the user uh, control screen I've clicked yes okay it's going to ask you to enter a product key uh, so you need to get your Windows 10 product key and paste it into there I'm just going to pause this and I'm going to copy and paste mine into there. Okay, so I just pasted my product key into there and I've clicked next. You've got two options now. You can upgrade this PC now. So that's going to upgrade uh, your existing operating system to the enterprise license. Or what we could do here is if you cl click on this option here, we can actually save it um, as a file. I know it's an ISO file. So just select that option and click next you can burn it directly to a USB flash drive uh, it will make that flash drive bootable so you can actually um, install Windows directly from that flash drive or you can create an ISO file which is what we're going to do here so I've selected ISO file click next okay it's then going to ask you where you want to install it uh, so just browse to where you want to save the ISO and I'll give it a nice name something like that and click save and it will save the ISO to your your drive uh, if you have any questions on this video uh, let me know in a comment below but thanks for watching I'll see you in the next video